welcome back to the Media Hub Minute. I'm your host, Justice Lewis. Here are a few top headlines from the Columbia Chronicle. Cinema and Television Arts is getting two co-chairs when Thelma Vicroy steps down at the end of the summer. Professor Wen Ma Zhao and Associate Professor Eric Scholl were just appointed interim co-chairs. School of Media Arts Dean Eric Friedman, who is also leaving the college, said the two longtime CTVA faculty have a complementary skill set across both film and television. Scholl previously served as interim chair of the department. Friedman also announced that he was appointing Peg Murphy to be chair of the communication department. Beth Davisberg has also been appointed chair of the science and mathematics department. Davisberg confirmed her new role to the Chronicle on April 28th. Columbia welcomes a new club for transgender and gender nonconforming students. TransFam was created by Howie Alston with the goal of sharing resources and building community amongst the Columbia trans and gender nonconforming community. There's so many trans and non-gender conforming people at Columbia, and I feel like some people are still in the closet, some aren't, so I thought it would be cool just to make a safe space for people. The club meets on Thursdays on the fourth floor of the library. I'm joined now by Chronicle Editor-in-Chief Olivia Cohen, who's going to talk about the latest print issue of the Columbia Chronicle. Thanks for joining us, Olivia. Happy to be here. So what can we expect for this next print edition? The Columbia community can expect a new newspaper dedicated to diversity, equity, and inclusion. It will hit newsstands tomorrow, May 2nd, and it can be found in any campus building. Thanks, Olivia. That's all for today's Media Hub Minute. You can read more on these stories at ColumbiaChronicle.com. I'm Justice Lewis. Thanks for watching.